Hey, welcome back to another video on the Far More Money channel. Uh, welcome back, everybody. Thanks so much for joining. Another uh, red day today um, overall in the portfolio. But hey, it's a great buying opportunity and time to get out there and spend some money in the market because it, the, you know some of these um, stocks are definitely at very good buy points. Apple, you know, even Tesla, right? From from that perspective. Uh, today, what we're going to be talking about is Ocular Therapeutics and why I think. It is a great stock to invest in, in terms of overall perspective, right? So I'm going to give you three good reasons to invest in this stock in this video. Stay tuned. So guys, why am I so bullish on ocular therapeutics? It's because it's going to solve AMD. Now, those of you wondering what AMD is, it's age-related macular degeneration, which is the leading cause of blindness among adults, guys. Now, there's already a product out there from another company called Regeneron Pharmaceuticals that has a product called Ilea uh, that inhibits uh, basically VEGF, which is like a growth factor uh, in the eye in order to prevent AMD from robbing patients of their vision. Now, if we take worldwide Aaliyah's sales, they already reached $8 billion last year, which is absolutely incredible. And the monthly injection will probably rake in $9 billion for Regeneron and its partners in 2021. So I'm already setting you guys up with the with basically a preface to Ocular Therapeutics's, you know, key uh, product that they're coming out with, which is basically going to rival, if not even be an addition to uh, Ilea out there. Uh, and this is going to be huge, guys. So big things for Ocular Therapeutics. They've got a item called OTX TKI, which packs axidinib in a glycol-based fiber that degrades slowly into an AMD patient's eye. Uh, early in testing, majority of patients reached the six-month check-in without needing any sort of rescue medication. So they had basically, um, you know, not just short-term relief from AMD, but the fact that they had long-term relief is key. And that's anything that's more than a month to two months out. So six months beyond, that's absolutely phenomenal. Once again, this is going to be a company that is going to shake a lot of things up. For those of you that are wondering, Regeneron, uh, which is another company that you know has this product called Ilea, uh, trades at an at a impressive, impressive, uh, you know, um, a price per share. So lots to like about Ocular Therapeutics, and let's keep digging in more. So Ocular Therapeutics has developed this item called the Hydrogel. So basically, I'm going to go over kind of their product called OTX TKI, um, kind of what it's found overall from all the studies that they've had on patients. Uh, OTX TKI was generally well tolerated. To date, they've ob observed to have a favorable safety profile in all fully enrolled cohorts. So basically, anyone in the studies has done really well, guys, which is awesome news. Also, preliminary biological signal of clinically meaningful decrease in retinal fluids. So the pressure in the eye has also gone down in about two months time, which is awesome, right? So if there's a decrease in intraretinal uh, pressure, uh, that's what we want. When AMD occurs, that's a lot of the issues that stem from it are, you know, intraretinal pressure and just um, severe pressure in the eyeball. Uh, therapy durability suggests extended duration of action. So as I already told you guys, um, they already... Uh, you know, followed up with patients at six months marks, and they found out that they are actually doing still extremely well doing, you know, uh, the eye pressure has been um, non existent. So another huge win for them. And then, you know, they've got the implant, which is biodegraded in all subjects by nine to 10 and a half months. So um, the implant doesn't stay in your eye forever. It does biodegrade over, you know, a period of time. Uh, and then the implant location observation suggests limited movement. So once the implant gets um, placed in the eye, it does not have extreme movement over time. It stays put, it, you know, it, it absorbs the medication over time and it does really well from that standpoint. So once again, Ocular's hydrogel technology is going to play a pivotal factor in the fact, in its growth as a stock and in its growth as a company, guys. So from a biotech move, Ocular Therapeutics already has Dextenza, which got approved by the FDA in 2018 for tiny tear duct inserts that slowly release dexamethasone, which is a steroid, over a period of time. Now in 2019, the FDA expanded Dextens to a long-term relief from post-surgical inflammation, um, you know, um, indication, which is awesome. Now the company is selling more than 5,000 units per month of Dextenza, guys. That's awesome stuff. 
50 million dollars in sales this year with plenty of room to grow ahead for Dextenza. There's also going to be Medicare, Medicare implications ahead for this uh, product, along with as well this other development that they've got in OTX TKI, which is Axitinib. Ex they are going to have Medicare, um, you know, involvement from that standpoint. So Medicare is actually going to declare these products as essential uh, for their patients, and so that they can get it covered under their Medicare Part Part B or Part A per se. So lots to like ahead in terms of that. Uh, I'm extremely bullish on the stock. I myself have have a position open already, especially this week with the red red days out there. Uh, great time to get in. Um, despite its share price running up more than 270 percent over this past year, it still boasts a relatively modest 1.5 billion dollar market cap at recent prices. The potential sales of Dextenza in its currently approved indications are growing at a pace that could make this stock a winner over the long run, guys. So once you factor in that along with the OTX TKI positive results um, over this past year, uh, this is going to be a company that has a, you know, a great run up ahead of it. And I am so excited to see what, what else they do. Uh, for now, I'm definitely, you know, buying, uh, you know, it's not financial advice that I'm providing to you. It's, it's up to you how you choose to manage your portfolio and what you choose to buy. From my standpoint, I'm just talking about what I see ahead for this company and ocular therapeutics will be a winner in the long term. Thanks so much. If you've enjoyed this video, if you did, please go ahead and hit the like button and please do subscribe. Turn on your notifications as videos are going to continue to pour in as we move forward through 2021. Uh, this is going to be the road and journey to wealth and to just massive portfolio returns as we move forward. Thanks, everyone.